What's up, you guys, and welcome back to another install on. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, I wish I would have recorded that. <laughs> no. oh, What's up you guys today we're gonna work on how to improve the storage space in your truck part 3 let's go One of the ways you can do this is by buying a lockable in-bed toolbox like this one It's really nice and it sits inside the bed I don't like the ones that stick out but that's just my personal preference The bad thing about these toolboxes though is that they're robbing you of a lot of space like here, I'm carrying this cardboard box that should have fit inside the bed, but it didn't because of the toolbox. So what I'm going to do instead is essentially convert my entire bed into a toolbox by installing a bed cover. I went with the Backflip MX4. Get this to do a backflip. So this goes towards the back and then when you fold it up it helps it hold it in place. Same thing on the other side. And then when you're not using this you can just clip it there. The drainage system. So you install it on the cover at the top and then hook up the hoses to those drains over there. To remind you to register your warranty. Installation sheet. Warranty information. Important information. Step first, yeah, yeah. prep the clean. area. Prep that area. Step two, follow Munoz Custom. Yes, sir. Step three, share the Munoz Customs page. Ah, see, sí. share the Munoz Customs page. <laughs> For all your decal needs, we have to install it closest to this edge. I'm really feeling like Bob Ross now. We don't make mistakes, we make happy accidents. This thing is not crooked anymore. And then we just trim the excess. If you want to cut the truck. Don't cut the truck. There we go. Okay, so now we install the rails. Each one has its proper side. This 
piece goes towards the cabin. Okay? And then it just sits on top. Flush, like so. Push it towards the cabin. And you take your clamps. And it's three on each side. Make sure the hex nut is towards the outside, more or less in the center of the rail. goes over on this side of the rail and on this side of the bed of the truck. Tight as fuck. I ain't going anywhere. Hopefully. This sign is kind of stupid because this should reach higher into the bed of the truck so it has better grip on it this side's fine and the rail is fine but it's only have grabbing like 50 percent that sucks and then for the other side same thing this bracket towards the inside and towards the cabin it's better with a helper so make sure you have someone to push it down while you bolt on the clamp and that's how I flush nice now we gotta install these clips they have two Phillips head bolts that go this way. These two pins that go towards the other way. All those two pins first. Hold them. Let's screw on the bolts. And now the other side. Make sure it's facing towards the back of the truck. This bolt's gonna go this way. Get that through. And we're gonna put the rubber washer, the stainless steel washer, the lock washer, and then the knob. We're not gonna tighten it just yet to be able to move it if it needs adjustment. So we got the rubber washer. Then the stainless steel washer. Then we drop the fucking lock washer. <laughs> oh, little fish for it like an idiot. These are part of the steps, guys. If you didn't drop it, I'll make sure to drop it. I don't think anybody has this bad of a look. Yes, I do. Okay. It, it builds character. <laughs> okay, got the lock washer on. Now the knob. Don't drop everything. Okay, and again, don't over tighten it yet. Make sure the cover is lined up properly. Push it towards the cabin.
Then you can tighten the knobs at the front. I didn't open the folds to avoid moving it out of place. I just crawled under it. And it's rated at 400 pounds, so it's supposed to carry me. Did it dent a lot? Not at all. No? Cool. Love it. So. Yeah. That looks sketchy, but it's supposed to hold 400 pounds of distributed weight. In case you want to carry any cargo on top of your cover, you can do so with the Backflip MX4, up to 400 pounds of distributed weight. The Backflip G2 can only carry 300 pounds. Just a disclaimer, I am not sponsored by Backflip. I bought this cover myself out of pocket because it's the one I like the most. Okay, so if you open it all the way, it hits your window. So we're gonna install some rubber pieces here so you don't damage your window. Wipe the edge with rubbing alcohol so the rubber pieces can stick. Peel off this tape. Due to the curve of the truck, this edge doesn't really hit, so I'm gonna stick it on closer to the middle instead. Like here, should be fine. Should be more fit. Okay, let's test it out. Yep, looks pretty good. And our stickers are protected. Now for the drain hoses. What was the size, Johnny GT? Seven eighths. I don't have it. Okay, so now this drain pipe goes from the cover through one of these and out the bed to drain all the water in case it rains or you wash your truck. So you need a 7 eighths drill bit. We're going to use a step drill bit. Yep, that's the step. Okay. And we don't have a 7 eighths, so this is as far as, far as it's going to go for now. Until I get to Munoz Customs headquarters number two, so I can get the proper size. Yes. And then insert up top here. Okay, and then we can run it through. That's how it's gonna sit. Once we get that 7 8 drill bit, then we can cross it all the way through. What are your That's thoughts it. on it? I like it. I just don't like that it writes up when I close the tailgate. I don't know what to think about that. You see it here? In the corner? It's not so bad on this side. On this side. Maybe, maybe I need some adjustment on the climb. I don't think so because it has a lot of movement here. See that? Mm -hmm. I don't like that. And it's just that particular corner. It messes with my OCD.
to open the cover, you just pull on this wire. And if you open it two thirds of the way, you can lock it in place with these straps. I wondered if these straps could actually hold it in place at high speeds. So I went to test it out for you guys. Turns out that yes, they do hold very well. This is what this channel is all about guys, scientific experiments. In case you need to keep your cover open, this keeps it propped up. And then it also has some on the other side. That's it.